Welcome back, Nerd Squad. My name is Roya Destroya, and this is Top 10 Nerd. And I am Danny Burke. I'm here today to help Roya with this list. Now, I'm from Most Amazing Top 10, which is also a Top 10 channel, but we do more kind of vague lists about pretty much everything in the universe, I think. If you want to check out what we do, then go and subscribe to our channel right now, and I'll see you in the next video. So sometimes the best part of a superhero movie isn't the plot, or the acting, or the romance. In fact, it's usually never the romance. Yeah, I think sometimes the best parts are the little gems you find stashed away in the scenes that just make you feel extra sharp. So let's take a look at the top 10 Easter eggs found in superhero movies. we have Iron Man. In this 2008 movie, we catch a glimpse of a famed Iron Man nemesis known as Fin Fang Foom, who has yet to receive his cinematic debut, that is, until this easter egg. In one scene, Tony Stark is zooming down a road which is decorated with a giant billboard. Out of focus and very brief, but the billboard indeed displays an image of the dragon-like Fin Fang Foom. That's a star roll right there. Alright, coming in at number 9 now, we have The Incredible Hulk. Now this 2008 movie gives a nice cute little nod to the Hulk from the comics, with a reference to wardrobe choices made by the big, mean and green man. In one scene, Betty Ross goes shopping for Bruce Banner as it becomes apparent he's going to need some new fashion choices. One of the clothing items she picks up are a pair of large purple pants, an easy easter egg for anyone who has read the comics to pick up on, as this was exactly what Bruce was wearing. In the end, the Incredible Hulk movie shunned adorning him in purple pants, but we will never forget them. Next at number 8 we got Avengers Age of Ultron. One scene in this 2015 movie has Tony Stark picking out a new AI butler to serve them after the departure of Jarvis. Going through his choices he comes across an AI known as Jocasta. Jocasta just happens to be the AI that Ultron created to be his wife, so I imagine the movie may have been a bit more twisty had they picked her from the catalogue. Alright, in at the number 7 spot now we have Man of Steel. Martha Kent's photo album contains this easter egg in the 2013 film. In it, there is a picture of Clark Kent in front of a school crest that says Weisinger Primary School. Now it turns out this is an homage to Superman editor Mort Weisinger, who was responsible for the hero during the Silver Age of the 50s and the 60s, and that was an extremely important time for soups, so this was a cute way to say thank you. Coming in at number 6 we have Spider-Man Homecoming. This new film had quite a few easter eggs packed into it, one of my favourites being respects paid for what happens in the comics. The scene where the vulture drops a bunch of rubble on Spidey is in fact straight from the comic The Amazing Spider-Man number 33, where a similar struggle happens to our friendly neighborhood Spider-Man, who finds himself under a pile of heaviness right on the cover of the comic. Not again, dude. Okay, next up now at number 5, we have the Avengers. Don't let your mom hear about this one. Apparently the filmmakers just wanted to have some fun by slipping this one in. In the 2012 film, Loki calls Black Widow a mewling quip, which sounds weird but harmless enough, until you take an olden day English lesson and realise that mewling quim translate into whining c**t. Nice one, Loki. Up next in number 4 is The Dark Knight Rises. The Dark Knight Rises was a phenomenal film, but many of us had to admit that we did miss the Joker, especially after his stellar performance. But it turns out our favourite villain may have made an appearance after all. In a scene where Bruce Wayne is sitting at a desk during the Batman statue scene, there is a magazine cover beside him that, if you pay close attention to and zoom in maybe 50 times, features the mean mug of the Joker. Even going one step further, the overhead view of the statue reveal resembles a smiley face. So he may be closer than we think. Okay, in at the number 3 spot now, we have Watchmen. The opening scene montage for this 2009 film was a work of art, especially the small scene with Night Owl, and it is rife with easter eggs. First off, the theatre is labelled as Gotham, and is playing a production called Die Feldmaus, which means the bat in German. Also, a couple is seen coming out of the theatre while another man is punched by Night Owl. Turns out this is Martha and and the guy is Joe Chill, their murderer. So in other words, Night Owl is changing Batman's entire world here. Nice. Coming in at number 2 is Thor. In 2011 this movie made a fleeting easter egg that even some hardcore Thor fans may have missed because it's very quick and pretty hidden. In one shot of the movie we catch a peek of a billboard advertising New Mexico with the phrase Land of Enchantment, Journey into Mystery. Just so happens this is the name of the comic book that Thor made his debut, Journey into Mystery number 83. And finally at the number 1 spot now we've got 
Wonder Woman. A photo was released before the 2017 movie of Zack Snyder on set dressed in war garb showing that he was going to be a US soldier in the upcoming film. After a lot of searching, the easter egg that is Zack Snyder was finally found. In the background of this scene, slightly to the left of Wonder Woman's group, the man is none other than Snyder himself. This was only made obvious in B-roll footage. So those were the top 10 easter eggs found in superhero movies. My name is Ray Destroyer. My name is Danny Berg. Make sure you do go and check out most amazing top 10. We've got plenty of videos. I'm not sure what our next one is, but I have a feeling you're gonna like it. Thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe so you never miss another nerdy list. Bye.